mono and polyunsaturated fatty acids. Fatty acids have a long hydrocarbon chain with a carboxyl group at one end. So here we have a long hydrocarbon chain and this end we have a carboxyl group. Saturated fatty acids have only carbon to carbon single bonds. So this fatty acid here, it has carbon to carbon single bonds, therefore it's a saturated fatty acid. The bond angle around the carbon atoms is 109.5 degrees, which has a tetrahedral shape. Unsaturated fatty acids have one or more carbon to carbon double bonds and the bond angle around the carbon to carbon double bond will be 120 degrees which is trigonal planar. Mono unsaturated fatty acids have one carbon to carbon double bond. Polyunsaturated fatty acids have more than one carbon to carbon double bond. So here we have an example of oleic acid which is a mono unsaturated fatty acid. It has one carbon to carbon double bond. This is linoleic acid, which is polyunsaturated fatty acid. It has two carbon to carbon double bonds. Next, we look at some examples of fats and oils, and we'll determine if they're mostly composed of saturated fatty acids, mono unsaturated fatty acids, or polyunsaturated fatty acids. So by looking at these chemical formulas for these fatty acids, we can determine the degree of unsaturation. So the less hydrogen atoms in the fatty acid, the more unsaturated it is, which means it contains more carbon to carbon double bonds. So this first example here, this is a saturated fatty acid composed of carbon to carbon single bonds. Then we have this example here. This contains uh, one carbon to carbon double bond. So therefore it's mono unsaturated. And the, Last two examples, they contain less hydrogen atoms, so therefore they contain more carbon to carbon double bonds, so they are polyunsaturated fatty acids. So if we start with tallow, we can see that it's mainly composed, well 52% of it is composed of saturated fatty acids. Then if we look at olive oil, we can see it's mainly composed of monounsaturated fatty acids. And the last example is linseed oil, well, that's composed mainly, we have 18% of this fatty acid, which is polyunsaturated, and 45% of this one, which is also polyunsaturated. So linseed oil is mostly composed of polyunsaturated fatty acids. And finally, peanut oil is composed of 47% monounsaturated fatty acids and 46% polyunsaturated fatty acids.